Hi, my name is Alec Koros. Uh, I'm at the University of Regina in Regina, Saskatchewan, Canada. Um, and my amazing story of the diagram that I published uh, it came with my 2006 dissertation. It was called The Network Teacher. Uh, it's a little diagram, pretty simple. Um, and it was the one piece that really uh, grabbed people's attention for my dissertation. Um, I, it's been seen hundreds of times. A lot of people would recognize it. Um, and it was translated in a number of different languages. There was uh, uh, Veja magazine uh, translated it into Portuguese, and they did some other graphic with it and, and some nice visualizations. Uh, Silvia Tosiano, uh, uh, known as Languages uh, throughout the World Wide Web, uh, she translated to German into uh, Spanish, and she did a nice other English rendition. Um, there's also uh, a Greek professor named uh, Stylianos Mystikidis, um, and he actually translated into Greek just recently. Um, and it's been used in reports and proposals, uh, all sorts of things. And I just think that um, the initial decision that I made around making it uh, a Creative Commons dissertation really changed everything. It's been on, uh, the dissertation itself has been on Scribe. It's had 26,000 views or something like that. And as an ac academic, it really answers the question, well, why do we publish? And I think this is an important answer to me that it just reaches uh, an audience that you would never see previously, that we've never seen before as academics, and it really changes um, really everything uh, around the idea of publishing. So I think it's important that this uh, amazing story of openness uh, kind of lends itself to others doing the same, perhaps, that uh, if you create something, even if it's a very simple concept, that you have no idea how far this could spread. All that, that little simple affordance of making it a Creative Commons or copyleft uh, licensed work, uh, it can take, you know, uh, wings of itself, it just kind of takes off and flies away and I think that's really important. In the back of our mind I think we always have to think about audience but really the most important piece is create good stuff and if it is good I think the network will just take it away. Uh, like I was actually told um, by one of my advisors that you're, you'll be lucky if this is read by you know a half dozen people, academics, and perhaps your mother will read it. And you know hearing that sort of thing really um, you know, why did you do this? Why did I put two years of work into this document when it's only got a small reach? Uh, and again, Creative Commons copyleft really changes uh, why we publish.